So, last week you had good preparation here in Bostad? Mm -hmm. Yes, I, I played very well last week. I did the final, so I'm feeling very good these two weeks. Yeah. How was the win today? The win? Yeah, it's like all the days, it's a little bit difficult play. But uh, I'm feeling very good, so I'm happy and I hope to play my best tennis tomorrow. Ranked 106, you should be the biggest tennis star in Sweden. But in Spain, you have 12 countrymen in front of you. How is that? Well, uh, I, I, I don't know. There is a lot of players in Spain. Uh, and I think this is good because uh, I play tomorrow against uh, other Spanish guy and I know him, he knows me and for sure will be a very tough match. Who was your biggest idol when we, when you were young? Yes, Ferrer, uh, Nadal for sure, but I always uh, I want uh, to watch the matches from Ferrer. Yeah. What do you say about the future for Spanish tennis? Because if you are 18 Spanish players on top 200, but you are the only one under 25 years old. So what do you think about the future? Uh, I don't know, it's very difficult, uh, we have a lot of players, top 100, but for sure uh, we will be, no, I don't know if 20 more, but uh, 10 is very good. But do you have any young players coming behind you? Behind me, yes, there is Munar, Pedro Martinez, uh, I don't know, I don't know more. Ramos Vinolas, you, you played him three times before and you won the last time. Does it mean anything for tomorrow? No, he's playing very good. Uh, he's winning a lot of matches. Um, for sure it will be a very tough match. How do you find Bostad outside the tennis court? Yeah, it's very nice. Very nice place, very nice hotel, very nice club. The weather is not very good, but, but it's all, all is very nice. We hope for sun the rest of the week and uh, good luck the rest of the week. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you very much.